the Dodge Durango is a classic example of the American approach to SUV design. First developed the Dodge Dakota pickup truck. And only then, on the basis of this small truck, they created an off-road, which may well qualify for a place in the executive segment, even though more than 70% of Durango parts migrated from the Democratic, hard work. Such unification provided the car with high reliability. And just look under the body to make sure that the car is destined for a long life. A powerful box-type spar frame, which evokes associations with a medium-duty truck, makes an indelible impression. The motor is protected by a powerful metal pallet, and all safety components and assemblies are covered by the same frame with seven crossbars. So, if you wish, you can crawl over the obstacle that has arisen on the way. Fortunately, for such maneuvers, the power of the power units is more than enough. But you cannot call them a wide choice. The reason is that the motors are similar to each other, all three B-shaped eights. The most popular in the domestic market is a 5.2-liter engine with a capacity of 237 liters. With, in 2000, it was replaced by a more modest unit, a 4.7-liter, which, nevertheless, produces one liter. With, more thanks to the improved design, for the more temperamental, a 5.9-liter engine, 249 horsepower, was offered. With it, Acceleration to 100 km h takes only 8.5 seconds, do not forget that the weight of the car is more than 2 tons. Average fuel consumption is about 20 liters per hundred. But there is an advantage, a huge engine resource before overhaul, exceeding 500,000 km. Most of the modifications, all-wheel drive, in many ways resemble and even copy the solutions that were used on the Jeep Grand Cherokee Road SUV. There was a choice between permanent, select track, and plug-in, command track, all-wheel drive. Moreover, the latter is equipped with a limited slip center differential, which allows you to move in 4x4 mode on paved roads. The torque is distributed unevenly between the axles, 48%, forward, 52%, backward, but if necessary, the viscous coupling built into the transfer case will direct the necessary portion of torque to the wheels with better grip. There should not be any particular problems with servicing the handouts, they are well known to Ukrainian craftsmen, since they were installed on Jeep Cherokee, Grand Cherokee at different times. There has not yet been a serious repair of handouts in the practice of specialists. However, like the automatic transmission, which is equipped with all Durangos, the suspension of the American off-road matches the general design, powerful, unpretentious, and reliable. The lower control arms of the front suspension are cast, not stamped, as on many SUVs. The rear one can serve as a standard of indestructibility, the continuous beam of the bridge is suspended on leaf springs. Even in our difficult conditions, she is distinguished by endurance. Experts say that the presence of a suspension should be remembered only every 100,000 kilometers. However, you need to be prepared for the high cost of spare parts and maintenance of the Dodge Durango, as well as problems with the availability of the right parts. A car for both a successful businessman, in the past, and a wealthy connoisseur of classic American off-road. Off-road capable of giving odds to many. A car is contraindicated for prudent pragmatists, a good appetite can overshadow the joy of travel.